Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. Why is that sticking up? I have no idea, but we're going to go ahead with the video. <laughs> so basically today I'm going to be trying out the infamous wet line gel. Now, I'm probably late on this train because a lot of people have already tried this out. You know what I'm saying? Honestly, I've had this for about six months, a little over six months, maybe like... I don't know it's been a really long time i bought it when it was popping okay and i just put it in my in my like hair bin and i was going to clean out my hair bin and i was like huh, i never did get any people review on this wet line jail okay <laughs> and a few people had asked me about it a while back but i was like i don't know where to freaking get that from girl i'm a dollar tree shopper okay so i went in dollar tree so i'm looking around i'm like what kind of new stuff they got in here girl do 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 I was like, oh my God, over there by the hair stuff or whatever, this is their Dollar Tree. I didn't even know. Okay, I know a lot of y'all probably be like, girl, whatever, it's been there. Eh, eh, eh. I didn't know, okay? So anyways, let me just cut the chase. What I'm going to be doing is, um, I'm going to be using this to see if I can get the wet look or to see if I can at least tame my hair with it. I've seen mixed reviews on it. I've watched a few videos see some mixed reviews so we will definitely see i have like opened it and touched the gel i will give my final thoughts at the end once we style the hair and everything like that this hair's information or specs jesus christ the specs of this hair will be down below this is the ally pearl water wave hair okay so we'll go ahead and get right into it i've already um combed out the hair okay and as y'all can see this hair is super 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 full okay but it's a look like i love this look right now but anywho i've already combed it out so that's key to whenever you want to do any kind of wet look or define some curls you definitely want to comb it out first and then you want to go ahead and take some water and get the hair like drenched in water and get it like really really wet okay i would really recommend if you have like a wig with a lot of hair kind of like this go ahead and wash it like submerge it under water and then put it on and do it because it's just gonna take a lot longer if you spray water on the hair but anyway i'm gonna go ahead and spray the water on the hair and then we're gonna get into the video see you then So my hair is well it's damp okay i actually got it all wet and then i started doing other things so it's pretty damp which is a great thing it won't take as long to dry so i have the gel right here and i'm just going to slather it all over my hair like i would do if i was creating a wet look or whatever so i'm going to do that and then put a blow dryer to it and let it dry and then i'll come back and talk to you guys about my thoughts on this this gel into this hair okay so this hair is from ally pearl this is their water wave i think and i think i have like four bundles i can't remember i'll leave the the like the specs of the links and stuff like that in the bundles down below but i know i do have an ear to ear frontal all right and i also leave the last video i did down below so i've been wearing this hair off and on for about two weeks now like two two and a half weeks now and the hair has been holding up great. Y'all know I love curly hair or wavy hair, so to say. It's more so wavy than curly. The only thing about it is you are, you are going to have to kind of manipulate it as you guys seen that I did now. So that is the way that I do it. Um, I would quite say daily, probably like every other day or every couple of days because although i've manipulated my hair like this now i could wear it for the curls for a few days uh, and um i do it probably like every other day so it is going to take a little bit of manipulation if you want your curls to be like really defined okay you're gonna have to give it some moisture and then put a little product in it but it's very low maintenance nothing that 
you know, nothing too wild and crazy that you just can't do. You know what I'm saying? But um, it then being that the hair that I am wearing is so long, you know, it does require a little bit more to do. But yeah, the hair has been holding up good. Um, no excessive shedding or anything like that. Y'all already know all hair sheds, so whatever. But it hasn't been anything that's just crazy globs in my, you know, hands or on the floor or whatever. <laughs> so none of that. I just, I haven't had any major problems with it or anything like that. And I always have it on always wear it and people are always like oh my god like the hair is so freaking pretty girl like they look like yo hair and i'm like girl it's a wig <laughs> but anyways guys i just wanted to come back and give you guys a little two week update almost three week update on this hair and like i said specs will be, be down below Dry. i will recommend you guys do this whole process off of your head i promise it'll take like no time just wash the wig and then drench it in the gel and let it air dry okay but i didn't do that i did it on my head and this is what it looks like yes all this hair is completely dry so yeah i think it looks super super good this hair is really really long on me so that's where it falls okay so initially i did not make a part on this wig it's just kind of like a flip over but anyways this is what the hair looks like so i think it looks really really good now my thoughts on this gel it's a very 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 lightweight gel it's super lightweight so upon me like just touching it okay like touching it and like rubbing it in my hands it's not sticky it's not tacky it does not feel like a gel at all it almost just feels like water and it just has like a just a regular like i don't know it doesn't smell too much like anything but like fruit or something but anyways it's just it's not tacky or anything so i was really kind of like I didn't think that it would really just work because it's not tacky. I guess I'm used to the Eco gel and other kind of gels that I use. This gel is equivalent to, let me show you. It's kind of equivalent to my ISO Plus gel. You guys know that I love this. And um, I usually use this in conjunction with the what's this stuff called the eco to get my wet look okay the iso plus gel is very 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 light that's like the lightest gel ever so that's kind of what this feels like but it even feels lighter than the iso plus so i was just like this isn't gonna work i you know i was kind of like writing it off before i had even tried it but it actually did work and one thing that i can say that i actually do like about the wet line gel is that it's I mean, with it being light, it doesn't leave the hair crunchy. It doesn't leave the hair hard. It leaves it like this, like that really, I don't know, natural type of a look, okay? It's not hard at all. Like this is the softest my hair has ever felt with doing the, um, the, with doing the uh, the wet look method. Oh my God, I can't even talk. <laughs> this is the softest that my hair and the most natural that my curls have ever looked. So I would definitely, definitely, definitely say that this would be a good buy. And being that it's only a dollar and it comes in this big, huge tube, you can't really beat that. It's cheaper than the ISO Plus and cheaper than the Eco Styling Gel, okay? This is gonna last you a really, really long time. Don't be trying to go lay your edges with this and do all it, okay? But in order, to, I mean, to like put in your hair, it would be great. As far as natural hair, I don't know how it will work with natural hair. I have no idea. I don't plan on using it on my natural hair. You guys can look at other tutorials on natural hair. But like for my weave to get like curls and stuff like that, I will definitely be using it. That's going to be added into my routine okay so have you guys tried the wet line gel let me know if you have or if you haven't um is it in you guys' local dollar tree because it, it was definitely in mine i'm pretty sure you can find it on amazon and other places like that if i do find the link i'll leave it down below for you guys so you can check it out and uh yeah i think that's it any questions comments concerns please leave those down below also and i'll see you on the next one